So, this is unprecedented. We're all experiencing a very strange time, and that means we have to think of clever ways to be mountain bikers whilst effectively living indoors. Certainly not action-packed mountain biking we all love to do. And I think that is a problem. So let's try and solve it. Firstly, it is really important to accept our responsibility to keep the pressure off our health services. The last thing they need right now is tons of broken mountain bike riders, riders who couldn't be patient enough to wait for COVID-19 to give us a break. The hard fact is we need to be good citizens and only do very gentle, safe and socially distant rides. Doesn't sound much like mountain biking I've ever seen. So everything here is to spark your imagination for things to do now off the bike and things to do now for riding in the future. So let's get going. So I've always been a daydreamer. Thinking about the things I'm going to do in the future is almost equal to what I'll actually end up doing. I like nothing more than fantasizing about a new riding location or a new bike. Something you can be doing now is setting riding goals. Where do you want to ride? What races do you want to enter? Is there a jump or a feature that you've been scared to hit? Think about it. Set some goals for your riding and work out how you'll achieve them. Planning a schedule of building up to bigger features and where those features are, for instance. Or plan a weekend away to hit a couple of massively popular bike parks that are far away but are worth the journey, the experience and the inspiration. You can start planning that now. This next suggestion is a bit sly because I'm slipping in a job here, but it's an important job and the current situation has provided us with the time to get it done. So why not service and deep clean your bike? I mean, Doddy has done tons of videos about this. The guy knows what he's talking about. Take the time to do all those bits of maintenance that get neglected. Get your bike feeling brand new and ready for the trails. This will be a chore at first, but once you get started and you make headway, you'll get right into it. By the time you're finished, the stoke on riding this beautiful bike will be high. And if you've let Doddy guide you through it, then you'll be way more knowledgeable as a cyclist than you were before you started. It's all good. Just when you thought I was done with the chores, I went and added another one, but wait. This one is going to make your life way more pleasant. So it's time to add a deep clean to your riding kit. Washing kit, yep. Yeah. If you're anything like us here at GMBN, your pads and your helmet liner are probably smelling pretty funky by now. And now that they're going to be shelved for a while, it's the perfect time to freshen them up. Give your helmet a wipe clean as well. Even though the dirt gives you character, the helmet probably looks good under all those mud splatters. What about a big binge on GMBN videos? We've got playlists with all our most viewed videos, challenges and personal favourites. Check them out in the description below this video. And what about classics like the death grip challenges? This is such a simple idea, but man does it produce some funny moments. If you've ever thought about what it would be like to see a grown man shake with fear, well, this is where you're going to see it. The games of bike are eye-opening too. You see some real riding talent in these videos because no rider wants to lose these little battles. And of course, the comedy level does get pretty high too. And the random tandem is a pot of gold. I can vouch for the fear on that bike, but all the videos seem to produce constant laughs and fun. Definitely worth a view. Lastly, what about getting the juices for the next trip flowing by watching some of our epic rides we've been on because we have been to some amazing places. Look at that, that looks amazing. Now I'm going to point you to a couple of classic mountain biking films. If you start searching on YouTube, you'll be able to binge classic MTB films that lay down an endless rabbit hole of content. There's loads of old school videos and newer riding films too on YouTube, so brush up on your MTB history with titles like Earth and Three Minute Gaps. Buckle up for some British action with a slice of British pie. There's so much to keep you excited about riding. Riders like Danny McCann Fabio Widmer, Brendan Fairclough, Sam Pilgrim, they've all produced MTB classics that will push you on each day. Lastly, what about building some things? We've had both Doddy and Blake making all sorts of clever devices, hacks and bodges that can seriously ramp 
quite literally, up your garden. A general tidy of your workshop is cool, but why not turn it into an absolutely classic bike cave? Get the TV in there, hang the bikes, make a cabinet perfect for your awesome tools. And if you just must ride, then what about some static ideas to get you on your bike, like a manual machine, or build yourself a set of rollers? It isn't the easiest of times, but once we're through this, your riding is gonna be an incredible experience. You need to start getting excited. Let me know in the comments down below if I've solved this problem. I probably have, it's probably solved now. And let us know what you're doing to get through this time and still be able to call yourself a mountain biker. Because you'll not only be telling me, you'll be telling all the other viewers and helping them out. Love, like and share on all your social platforms and don't forget to subscribe to GMBN and I'll see you next time for another Problem Solved.